Hi there, today, today we are looking at uh, a mobile gaming controller uh, M05. This is from Easy SM SMX, and uh, it has compatibility with all this. Uh, that's the USB C plug, and it's adjustable, and it has programmable buttons, responsive. Uh, D-pads, precise 3D joysticks, whole uh, linear trigger, app customization support, and this charges with uh, 15 watts uh, fast charging. So yeah, let's uh, open it up and quickly see what it's all about. So just to confirm, there's no battery inside. And it works with iPhone 15. Uh, and Android. So yeah, let's see what we have in here. Let's uh, what we have. They say game and game of choice, but we'll see about that. They have some instructions, and that's the controller itself. So, from start, yeah, that's quite nice joystick, joysticks. Seems like it has good buttons as well. And you should expand. Kind of like that. And this is where my uh, Samsung Galaxy S24, <laughs> 24 Ultra phone is. And, um, it looks like you will definitely fit. You will even fit a bigger phone than that. So that's really good. Um, customizable on the back. Nice texture. And you see this is adjustable, like they said. Just moves around. Uh, this is rubber to protect your phone. Um, yeah, really, really impressed so far. You see how it feels? Nice. It really sounds really good. I'm not even exaggerating. What are they saying there? Okay. FN, FN plus turbo. Key for two seconds. So you switch from all these uh, modes. So uh, the buttons will work, you know? So. And you should see the color in here. So if you're not playing uh, PS mode, that's only on iOS works. It goes to green. Uh, on Android, you get three different uh, options. M, virtual touch, Xbox mode, and HID mode. That's quite cool. Uh, and that's the USB-C uh, for charging. Very convenient. Uh, the cable down, not up to obstruct you. Yeah. Uh, let's take a phone and see um, how, he, how it looks like. Okay, so while the games are downloading, let's just plug this in and see um, So I would normally push it like that. And then when you're in a place, make sure you align it and push it. We'll see if it works with the case though. Not 100% sure. If it's, uh, I need to be removed. What was he saying in here? Uh, FN, FN turbo key for two seconds. Uh, where's the turbo key? It's the turbo FN. But I think, guys, I need to remove the case, I think. Although it's quite long, it looks like the zoom wants to do it. So let me take out the case. And hope for the best. I wish I could have left the case in, but you see now it's plugged in and it's vibrating, and all the good stuff are happening. So, um, I think it's already in the mode that it needs to be. Yeah, green. So he knows. That's pretty good. 
<clears throat> it's a bit uh, moving in here. Okay, so let's see. They also said uh, you shouldn't have an app. Really loving this. So let's see what kind of uh, app do we need to install. We just install it for the best. Uh, where is your app? You definitely said in here. So maybe that's the app. Let me just quickly install it. I'll scan this barcode with my phone. Okay, guys, so for the app, it looks like it takes you um, to Gamer's Choice website. So I'm not sure. Uh, if that's the app, let me see from the app store. Okay, guys, so I've connected my phone. I've installed Asphalt 8. So one thing I've noticed, you, you already goes to into green, which is good for iPhone. Uh, but one thing um, that didn't work, it was the controller. Uh, so in order to make it to work, I had to press and hold these two buttons uh, for two seconds. One, two, three. I think that was enough. You see, so it says controller disconnected, yeah? Um, so you press again. And it changes mode, yeah? So you press again. It changes mode. You press again. And then it says controller connected. So there you have it. Not sure why, uh, but now it's connected so I can actually play. Hopefully. Uh, What's happening there? So, yeah, as you can see, I can control it. Uh, learn to drive. I don't want to learn anything. Uh, the one thing I want to do, uh, because um, uh, let me go back in here. And your notifications, I don't want any notifications. Uh, but one thing I want to do, just I want to stop any music if it allows me to yeah and the rest of it I don't mind make sure you did that yep okay so let's just play see how it goes but uh, I'm liking the position of it it's so nice sounds really nice obviously thanks to the iPhone um, and then uh, obviously nice display and uh, yeah you can control everything with this the buttons are really good so let's let me just show you a bit of gameplay brake is on top Really pleasant game and pleasant experience as well overall with this. That's interesting, I didn't realize you can actually move the car with this other joystick as well. So yeah, not bad I would say. I kind of know how you, how you roll back. There was one way of doing this flip, but just can't remember now. So yeah. Seems like it's moving very, very nice. Let's just win this race. So yeah, I'm really loving it. This town as well. Well, yeah. Um, I mean, what can I say? It's working beautifully. Nice toast, but yeah, you get the idea. Really nice um, experience. Uh, I'm loving it. <laughs> this is actually my favorite um, 
uh, mobile gaming controller for phones. And what's nice, it's, um, it's going to fit my Samsung Galaxy S24 uh, Ultra as well. So yeah, uh, I, ho I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Um, yeah.